sensation at Flemington today with champion jockey Michael Clark riding all four winners of the Quadrilla. There was another winner for him in the $200,000 weight for age Craig Lee Stakes over 1,600 metres. Colin Hayes had the odds on favourite, Liston Stakes winner Military Plume and Clark did the rest. Military Plume has raced up on the outside to tackle Society Bay, 250 to go. The others are struggling, headed by Royal Heights, and down the outside was our Waverley Star, but here's Military Plume, let go. Ranged up, got a head in front of Society Bay, two lengths to Royal Heights. Then our Waverley Star and Dazzling Duke, but it's Military Plume, too good, and races away. And Military Plume is one of the lengths Society Bay, a half length away, third, a good run, Royal Heights. Military Plume was the odds-on favourite at 9 to 10, second was Society Bay at 11 to 1, and third Royal Heights at 25s. Another $200,000 race followed that one, the 1200 metre Ascot Vale Stakes for three-year-olds. And that Colin Hayes-Michael Clark combination took the money again, with Karpstad too good in a super finish. They're at the 400 metre mark and Kennedy ran show ruler the centre, wider on the track, calf set of clear. Of Disputed Pearl followed by Lonely Dreamer from Omnicorn, well back Hello Melbourne and Gold Trap is finishing on. Coming down towards the 200, Rancho Ruler on the inside and Carpstead. Rancho Ruler takes the lead from Carpstead. 100 metres left to go is clear of Carpstead. Lonely Dreamer getting out and Gold Trump coming home well. Rancho Ruler on the inside, tackled by Carpstead. They are going to the line, locked together. Oh, Carpstead I reckon might have grabbed Rancho Ruler. Karpstad took the photo and started at 11 to 2 and Rancho Ruler didn't get second, it was Lonely Dreamer starting at 100 to 1. Rancho Ruler third was the favourite at 7 to 4. And the daily double from headquarters today for the numbers 1 and 10, just $88.05 and the